a land with much promise and possibilities, not just for its people but for the world, describes Guinea, a French-speaking country in West Africa. This country, with its massive wealth in natural resources, has been a key contributor of bauxite and iron ore to the world economy for the manufacturing around travel, community infrastructure and economic productivity. Yet for all this, the Ghanaian people have little to nothing to show for what their homeland has given to humanity. But a new day is dawning here. Rio Tinto and a consortium of investors are injecting $20 billion into the region for a new mining facility and railway to extract more iron ore for the world's market demands. The railway will send out iron ore and return goods and services from the world that should benefit the Ghanaians. This makes Siddiqui, an American Ghanaian electrician, happy. Yet he also understands that his people lack the one true resource needed to take advantage of and become full members of the global community, power. For less than 1% of the amount being invested in his own region, a hydropower plant potentially could return tenfold in productivity in Zeri Kuri. It would increase access to healthcare, education and training via internet, mobile banking and microcredit, food processing and so much more. Siddiqui envisions electricity as the key that unlocks promise and possibilities, not only for the world, but even for his fellow Guineans. <laughs>